George never envisioned Star Wars to be what it is today, the second biggest film franchise ever. But I wonder if the toxicity of some fans gets to him, even today. That toxicity is alive and well. We can see that toxicity here. We can also see it here. And also here. Look at the racism Moses Ingram recently experienced. And fuckers like these have the nerve to downplay it as if it's nothing new. Is this a community we want? We don't need a cult of negativity for a community. Bashing a character you don't like is understanding, un understandable. Bashing the actor is not. I'm sick of people supporting this disgusting behavior. There are some people who still whine constantly about the sequels. Here's something hard to swallow. Grow the fuck up. By the way, I don't love the sequels either. But you don't see me posting garbage content bashing them constantly. Hate to break it to you. A lot of us have moved on. Including me. We have series that we are looking forward to. We're excited for Star Wars, finally. And that's a feeling I haven't felt in a long time. During the sequels, I was a, a little bit hyped, but it doesn't compare to how I am hyped right now. And that's the thing I'm looking to, forward to. The future. I don't look at the past as much as I do the future. And I look at the present. Isn't that what the Jedi said? Look at the present, not the past. I don't know. It's just all this negativity in the Star Wars fan brace is just really bringing down a good time we're having. We all seem to be getting along, and then people have to say racist things to actors and be just terrible human beings to people, and it's not reflective of the Star Wars community at all. And it's something I had to get off my chest. I'm not going to sit here and watch stupid ass people be fucking terrible human beings and say vile shit to people who are just playing a role. They're just trying to be the character that they were hired to play. And you guys give them, and some of the fans, I shouldn't say you guys, some of the fans give them the most vile and terrible shit in they unfortunately have to respond and they have to deal with that. And it's disgusting. And I know there's people in the community that support that type of stuff. I know I'm not going to name any name. Well, I already did, but I think it's more than just them. It's a lot of people. And people like me had to stand up and say, this is not all, this is not okay. This is not all right. In the Star Wars community, everyone needs to be accepted, and you can have your own opinions. Don't just lash out at actors they are just reading the script. And I think uh, situations like Moses's are going to continue to happen. We've seen this with Ahmed Best, Jake Lloyd, even Ewan McGregor, and Hayden Christensen, and Kelly Marie Tran in the sequels. So... It's definitely not something new and it's not going to end anytime soon. So I'm just going to say my piece. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe and don't let the haters get to you. Peace.